Hello everyone, this is Dante Collector with another action figure review, and here we are going to build Rintra from the Doctor Strange Multiverse Man Madness wave. So we went through all the figures in the wave to build them, so we already did Astral Form Doctor Strange right over here, Master Mordo, Wong, Doctor Strange, Rick Chavez, Sleepwalker, and Despair. Defender Strange is a uh, deluxe figure from Target, so don't worry about him, he's just there because he's part of Doctor Strange Multiverse Madness, but... Yeah, let's start building them. So first we'll grab the torso from Merc Chavez. We got the head from the Astral Form Doctor Strange. The left arm from Wong. Right arm from Master Mordo. And then we got the um, right leg from Sleepwalker, I believe. And then left leg from Despair. And then we got the two extra hands, fisted hands. So we'll just build them, build this guy first. So first off, we'll go with the legs. It should tell you also in the bottom where it says L. So this one says L, so it should be on the left side actually. So I got them flipped. Yeah. No, I got the I got it right because it should be his left, not my left. There we go. Just pops right in there like that. And then the other side. Just like that, popped right in. Then we'll grab his right arm, pop that in, easy. Left arm, pop that one in. And then pop his head in. Boom, easy. So yeah, there is that. We'll raise this up a bit. So let's bring him up close. So actually first we gotta do the hands, accessories. So here we got a fisted hand. You got the Thumb and three fingers. It gets lighter here. You got green fur going on here. It's a disc hinge, so that's pretty cool. And your normal hand. So yeah, there's that. And then now here is Rintra up close. So yeah, you, you got a lot of texturing here in the nose and mouth area. And then you got the really long horns with a lot of actually painting and washing here, which looks pretty cool to make it look like a horn. And you got this like little mane area or hair on the top of his head. You can even see, and you get the ears here too, which looks pretty cool. And then on one ear, you actually got like ear rings in them, so that's cool. You get the like pissed off eyes here, so that's pretty cool. And you get some like wear on the nose, I guess, to give it some nice texture look or something like that. You got the fur, and then you got his suit here from Dora, uh, not Dora Milaje. Whoop, my camera cut off for some reason, but here is fur, looks pretty good. You get the wristband, open hands there, so that's pretty cool. Light in the inside, gets more green in the outside. And then here you got like these thinner wristbands, which is nice. And then here is his legs with the fur. You get these like, I forgot what you call these, but um, it's gray. Uh, I don't know what you call them, but uh, let's go over the articulation. The, the tail fell out. Uh, we could just pop that back in. It's not that big of a deal. All right, so now articulation. So he has a double wall joint in the head. Looks down that far, up that far, left and right. A lot of head pivoting there. Shoulders move out that far. 360 rotation there. He has single jointed elbows, so it goes up that far. Rotation there. Wrist hinge down that far. Up that far, 360 rotation, ball joint at the waist, so you can look, go down, go forward that far, backward that far, side to side motion, uh, twisting, legs actually kick out that far, forward that far, pretty good, backwards now a whole lot, you got thigh cut, you got single joint knees, and you can also rotate around there. He also basically has a boot cut right there, and then ankles can hinge up and down and ankle pivot so yeah that is wrench off for you i the only problem that i have with it is kind of hard to get him to pose up because of his legs so you kind of have to get his legs perfectly balanced or perfectly like arranged so that way he can stay balanced um but besides that i think it's a really cool figure he has a decent amount of art articulation for a build a figure to be honest 
especially in the head. Arms are pretty good. Legs are awesome. Uh, now a whole lot of builder figures have that uh, good of articulation of the legs. Also, like the hip ball joints actually help a lot for this figure. So that's nice. Um, but yeah, I think it's a really cool figure. I, I do recommend trying to finish him, actually. Um, I cannot wait to see him in the Doctor Strange movie. Uh, I feel like if you don't finish him and you miss out on the wave, you're going to miss out on building them, which also means, yeah. Um, but besides that, I think it's a really cool figure. Um, but I know some people might not want to get all these figures to build them, so maybe try looking on eBay. Um, offer up for the pieces if you don't want to buy all the figures for the wave. But really, I think this is a really cool wave. Um, besides the astral form, Doctor Strange, to be honest, that was kind of the eh figure for me. But they did a really good job in the paint, sculpting, and everything on the sphere. So I, I think it's a really cool figure, like I said. So uh, that's all I got. If you guys want to check out my uh, link tree in my description, it ha has my TikTok, Twitch, and Instagram if you want to help support me on those. If you guys want a more uh, just brief review on this figure, go ahead and check out my TikTok because I do reviews on figures on there too. They're only limited to three minutes, so there's that. But besides that, thanks for watching.